Hello and welcome back to House Flipper. Eric and Twins 28 here. How you doing, everybody? In the last episode, you saw we finished the house that was hiding something. We sold it for a nice profit. We bought the Breaking Bad house for our own. For our own. And we also bought a second house, the Unsatisfying Effects house. Well, as you can see, I'm standing in front of an abandoned house that I purchased, a third one. And after all the things I put into the Huckster house, I decided that maybe I should get top dollar for it so we can buy some of the more expensive houses later on. So I bought this house and completely gutted it. And this is going to be our new office. This is our new office. So I'm going to show you some pictures here that I took. Unfortunately, I won't be able to blow them up because it'll create a poster, but this is the before, which is what it looks like right now, outside. This, see here, I'm trying to remember. I had another picture that showed the living room. This is the living room looking into the bedroom. You go into the front door and turn left, and that's the bedroom right there. This is the bedroom right here. This is the living room looking into the kitchen area down the hall and then of course from the kitchen looking into the bathroom so this is that was the before and here's the after the, the door is new I put in a white door and here is the entryway or the lobby area two chairs I'm not done decorating yet it's pretty pretty bare bones right now a couple chairs a TV in the corner these hooks were actually on the walls when I started painting. I didn't even see them because the walls were so bad. I started painting, and they showed up. I'm like, oh, I'll just keep them. We can hang door, uh, hang uh, chairs. Excuse me, hang coats and stuff there. But this co this color, I like this. This is copper, copper coin or coin copper or something. Let me check here. It's like one of the literally one of the first colors you pick up on the game. Oh, copper coin, yeah. That was this color. So I painted the entire place. So what I did was I gutted the whole thing. I took, I knocked all the walls down. Because originally you come in the door here, you look to the left and there was a bedroom there. You come around here and this was the living room and then there was a doorway here. You go in the doorway, there was a kitchen and then you go through the doorway and there was the, main, the, the full bathroom. Oh, I gutted everything, took all the walls out. And then I added a new bathroom, half bath, just a toilet sink, looks good, nice, and then my office, which is bare bones, but this is what my office looks like. I did have chairs in here, but for some reason didn't save when I quit last time, so I'll have to fix that. Okay, you see I got my laptop, I got my nice desk, so I got some decorating to do. I got some things to add, but it looks, this is a new office. So with that said, let's go to the Breaking Bad house. I'll show you what I did, and then we're going to sell it. And then once we're done with that, we'll go over to the other house that I'm working on that is still under construction. This is going to be a quick video. i got to get some sleep. It's Thursday. Thursday the, 6th, uh, the 26th. And uh, tomorrow night at midnight, here in Minnesota, our stay-at-home order goes into effect for this coronavirus crap and the funny thing is my work my the company i work for the industry we're in we are essential so we're considered to stay open but i think there's a way for us to if we want to stay home play it safe i think we can i'm going to look into that tonight when i go to work because i honestly i'm high risk i have diabetes among other things going on in my health i'm high risk to get this coronavirus crap. So I think for this, for my family's safety and my safety, I might be taking my two weeks to stay home. I will just hunker down because this coronavirus is getting worse. Um, nothing's worth. No job is worth going into to get possibly infected if I haven't already been infected. I'm not, I have no symptoms, but you never know. I could be carrying it. I don't know. So that's what I'm going to be doing tonight when I go to work. But here's the Breaking Bad house. As you see, I painted it from that 
yellow there to a cocoa color. It looks like a burnt red orange. It looks great. The whole house. Right, let's go in the front door. Here's the living room. And this paint job inside pretty much the entire house with the exception of bathrooms is this silver glacier. It kind of looks white, but I, I went with the silver glacier and it really pops. Got some nice blue curtains that look good. Got my Chinese lamp there that I like. Brand new fireplace that works. Nice painting on both walls. Got a love seat and a couch. I put up this divider wall. Got the accent color on it. This is where the laptop originally was on this wall on this desk here. Nice dining room table with a china hutch. And here's the nice kitchen I created. And originally the kitchen was up to like right like right here. It, do, 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 do. But I thought I want to make it bigger. And I like these cupboards, but it wasn't working perfect. And there's no good corner. Uh, this one didn't have a corner one where there's an opening and then you can stack them. They do 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 do. Because I tried doing that, tried stacking one of these in front of this, and I couldn't do it because of the stupid handle. So I was like, okay, let's do this. So I got a nice counter from here all the way to the pillar. And then I turned this one around facing that way so it could fit here. And then the rest of the counters fit right in perfectly. So this one can be like for, for like, um, silverware, or not, not silverware, I'm like, like if you're having a party and you put a, a placemat, placemat, something like that. We got a nice kitchen, they got an island. Coffee machine, coffee pot, microwave, knives, tools, double sink with so soap, dish rack, um, recipes, trash can, a uh, nice oven, oven set up with a wall, nice stackable fridge. And then I got a stove top here with the accoutrements. So this is one of the nicer kitchens I've ever worked on before. Got a little clock up there. And as you can see that throughout the entire house, I got the mini halogen lights. I like those. This is the kids' bedroom. This was originally going to be the office, but I made this a kids' bedroom instead. Because why not? Oh, got locked out. Um, Okay, so we'll go to the garage first. This is the garage. Same paint job except for this one. The workbench area. I painted that coal. I think that's moody cobalt or cobalt or moody blue or something. Here's the laundry room. This is the room I built. I basically took some space away from the bathroom. And then I built a laundry room just off the garage here. So I'll go back in here. This is the, ba the main bathroom. It is a full bathroom. You know, it's tiny. Nice paint job. This is the same paint job I used in the other house. Um, and I know which one it is, too. I can show you. Let's go to paint. Let's go down. It's way down here. It's like ice blue. That's the one right there. And I think this is the one in the garage. Moody Cobalt. Yep. This is the one I like to use in the bathroom. So it just, it's a nice bathroom color. And... If I use that, say I want to t use tile, I can use that with this cayenne tile. Like if I did that with a bathtub or a, a shower. I could easily put some in there, but I like, nah. But I like how this turned out. So that's the guest slash kids bathroom. I probably should have put a tub in it, but no, whatever. Okay, so here's the bedroom. You remember in the last video. There was a door here that went into that closet that had the, the hidden money. That's been walled off and expanded into the bathroom. This is this room was kind of odd angle. And it kind of jutted a little bit. So now it's a, f a perfect square. A little smaller than it originally was, but it's still a good size for a, a master. And I like I like this room. So here's the bathroom. I got gray on the wall here. I think that's the same as the out in the rest of the house. Nice kitchen or kitchen. Nice uh, sink. Nice big ass bathtub, and I put the tiling here. 
on that wall and that one, up, lined up to that. And this rug here to cover up that hole in the wall, or in the floor where the money was. I just could not, you can't fill it in or whatnot. But I got lucky in this tub, or this uh, rug fits perfect. And I can lay the tub right on top of it, so it's perfect. So that's pretty much it. This house is done, though. And I wish I could add more to the outside, but like I said, the DLC for Garden Flipper is not available. But I, th I just thought about it, and I'm like, you know what? I put so much money into this, I could really make a good profit. And honestly, who wants to have their office in their house? I could keep it, but I could, at the same time, you don't really live in the game, so whatever. So that's the Breaking Bad house, and we're ready to sell. Bought it for $94,000. The house has eight rooms. My budget is $83,000. And I worked on this house for over five hours. Let's put on the auction. I think one of the families are going to buy this. And I think it's going to be the Smoth. Yep, there it is, 141. Profit of 50,000. Jack Terrington came, came through. Uh, we renovated 2000 in budget. We bought 12000 in furniture. We sold 17000 in furniture. That includes the money we found. So let's negotiate. Pra. Let's see if I can get... Not sure I'm going to get much more, but I'm going to try. Let's get the full. I'm going to try and get the five. Do an extra five. see here 43 oh here we go let's do 44 okay seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen let's do that one 44 can you give it to me and they do so we got 55,000 so we will accept the offer breaking bad house has been sold not bad I want a place for my documents and books in my house. Well, you're going to have to get a different house because this one's not for sale right now. Right, right, right. So now we're sitting at 229000 So now let's go to Unsatisfying Effect, and I'll show you what I've been doing on that one. That one is not done. That is in process right now. I still got a ways to go, but it is cleaned out. I have modified some rooms. I have added some stuff. So, I don't think we're going to make as much money on this one as we did the last one, because that, that one was a special house, but, yeah, you never know. Actually, I think this one was, I think we purchased one. Actually, the other one was 94000 this one's 101 so this one might actually make some more money. Okay, so, there was a door here that's been walled off. That was into that little closet right there. This one is a bedroom. It's cleaned pretty much done it just needs to be furnished so then we come out here and what the f there's a floating so okay here's the deal here this has totally been opened up this wall was originally where that was right there I believe or maybe in so I want all this to be uniform so I brought it in a little bit so the, so the hallway is gonna be a little smaller but it's going to come up to here. Now this is going to stay open, but I'm going to put the smaller lintels. What do they call that? Lintel. Lintels. Yeah, I'm going to put the smaller lintels throughout there. Right there was a second bedroom. This is going to be the living room. And I'm going to put up another um, dividing wall. You know, be open on both ends. And then we're going to do kitchen. And then this, of course, will be the dining room leading out to the deck. There was a door here, a sliding door that went into that office area. That has been walled off. Let me get rid of that. That has now been turned into a bedroom. 
So we're gonna go down the hallway. Okay, there was another door here that went into a like a half bathroom that had a toilet. And then there was another room that had the shower and the bath or no, a bathtub and a sink. That's been walled off. All those those three rooms. These two here and the one that was over here, that smaller room, are now all co connected together. This is where the, that safe and that poster was. I put a door in here into that room that I walled off on the other side. And this is now a bedroom. This will be a bedroom. Oh, I didn't clean that window. Huh. Did I clean this one? Nope. I'll do that later. So we got another bedroom. That's going to be a little smaller than that other one over there. And here's the other bedroom. The master. Added a door here. Going into the bathroom. And that paint bucket. Eh, it's still got stuff in it. Okay. So here's the bedroom. Or the bathroom. Excuse me. Yeah, I know that's kind of stupid, but... Honestly, in real life, that would just hit hit it on the other side, but whatever. Shower. Radiator rack. I'm going to put a sink in right here with a mirror. We'll go there. Toilet's going to go down here. This is where the door leading into that one room out to the hallway was. And then now the sauna, which hasn't been built yet, but this is where the sauna will be. Once I get all that done... Uh, this house will be done. So that's pretty much it on this house. I'm not going to bore you guys with any design details. But, um... That's pretty much what's going on in this house. This house is looking good. I've... Bought it for 101000 I doubt it. If I sold it, tried selling it now, I'd make, break it, make or break that. So I'm going to have to do some work. But uh, I think it's going to be pretty pretty standard. This room is pretty much done. I just got to add some lights and some bedding. Um, I think this will be like a guest bed. I think this will be like the guest room. So I'll make this like really nice guest room. Or actually, no, I'll put the kids here. I don't know. Maybe I'll put kids here. I don't know. Make it an office. I really want to sell it to one of these guys. So I don't know, but... We'll get it figured out. So let's go back to the office. And we'll contemplate our next purchase. With the Breaking Bad money. That I gained from the sale. And I'm thinking about for this house. The outside once I clean up the dirt and stuff around it. Um... Probably going to do them brick again. Just because I like it and it's easy to install. Let's turn that TV off. Okay. Shut the door, please. Good. Okay, let's go here. So this will just be a fairly quick episode. Um, let's see what we got. House after flood, home car. I got 230000 Boring House, Pink Kingdom, Man Cave, Home Alone House is still pricey. I can't afford it. That Man Cave one would be nice. Oh yeah, yes. Let's do that one next. Yeah, I want to do that one because that one I needed. I did that in, on the PC version and I liked it. So we'll go check this one out, and then I think we'll end the video here. This one's nice. I like the front yard. Nice trees. Man cave. World's best dad. Oh my god. This house is a mess. This is interesting. Big ass brick. And then the rest of the house is painted. We might keep that, but we might change it up a little bit. Okay, so we got a kitchen right here in the front with a washer. That makes no sense. Okay. So we got 
living area, dining room. Let's see here. That was the door to get in. What's this? This is a bathroom. Okay, good to have one on the main level. I like that. Let's go. Uh, this is a bedroom. I'm guessing master. Tiny ass bath bedroom. I'm guessing this goes downstairs. Nope, this is garage. What the hell? Oh, here's a door right here. That goes downstairs. Oh. Oh, use. Yep, I bet you I gotta do that. Yep, assemble. Yep. Okay. So we're down here in the basement. Get some trash out of my way here. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, this is nice. Man cave. Look at this. And this is pretty much clean. This is nice. This is pretty much done. I like this. Wow. Oh, I was just going to clean this up a little bit. and Yeah. This room's done. Wow. Oof da. Nice. Nice guitars. I like that poster with that Mustang on there. This must be a... Yep, bathroom. Bathroom's done. It's clean. This looks good. I think this one I'll leave alone. There's nothing, no reason to fix it. So pretty much the upstairs and the garage need to be clean. This is going to make some money. This is going to be a money maker. So I'm going to put some money. I'm going to put some serious money into the upper upstairs and really make it bling. We're going to clean this up. We might make some kind of storage in here. But uh, yeah, this is a great property. I like this one. Let's see if we can maybe top breaking bad with this one. So I think we're going to call it good for now. Quick video. Just want to show you guys what up. what's up. We got a new office, our third one. Sold the Breaking Bad house. Looked great. I'm glad we did it. It's unsatisfying. Effects house is in full reconstruction right now. So in the next video, we'll have the unsatisfaction house will be done. And I'll reveal that and we'll sell it. And this one will probably be done too. And the office, the new office, will be fully furnished and ready to be shown off. And then we'll get ready to the next purchase. So I'm thinking of the next two houses, this one and the other one, that should give us enough money, hopefully, to buy the Home Alone house. Because I think that, that or the Barbie house will be ones we're going to work on. So, if you like this episode... Please hit that like button. Leave a comment if you like, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time on the next episode of House Flipper. Till then, peace out.